Wow. Look at that. It's a new world. A monster hunter world. Boy, oh boy, I can't wait to find out what kind of grand adventures that I'll- <laughs> Everybody, this is Kakato, and I am the final boss, and welcome to Monster Hunter World. Here's a pop quiz for everybody. How many Monster Hunter games have I played? If you guessed zero, you'd be absolutely right! <laughs> I'm gonna die. But hey, I did at least play the beta, so maybe I'll do okay, question mark? I guess we're gonna have to see. So, because this is technically my first Monster Hunter, truly, I'm gonna have to ask all of you Monster Hunter veterans and uh, pros at so just Monster Hunter in general, please be gentle with me. I'm gonna try my best. Hey, my Skyrim VMR update has finished. Whoopee! Here we go, everyone. We're about to step into a whole new world. A monster hunter world. <laughs> oh, help me. Sisters and brothers of the Fifth Fleet, it's time. Grab your things. We're I'll going to the Olive Garden. Brief. Never was much with words. Once you board this ship, there's no turning back. Literally, the rudders are broken. The next ground your feet will touch will be that of the new world. If any of you have lost your nerve, then step away now and let no one judge you. Except for Frank, for he has been banished well. to the new world. Then <laughs> sail safe and strong, and may the Sapphire Star light your way. Do not forget to stop by the gift shop. Please, do not forget to also send me a postcard. I get very lonely when everyone goes off to the new world. So very lonely. Oh, we have a bar ship. I think this is a ship. Are those cats drinking? We have cats drinking! This is already my favorite thing. Hey, what you got there? I want it. I want a wrist mounted crossbow. I want it. Is that a cat chef? They're serving up entire hams to these people. Good God, the protein that they eat. They must be on the GA diet. Eat as much meat as possible and then work out like crazy. I can dig it. Hello, madam. What are you eating there? Yo, did you hear? We're almost there. Uh, yay! You ready to grab this new world by the horns? Sure. Stop staring at me that I don't way. I know about you, but it feels like ages since I left home to join the commission. So, nervous? You're making me nervous, sir! Leave you me. I get it. Anything could happen to us, but hey, that's yep. happening. Uh. Hey, aren't you one of the A-list hunters? Uh, I'm, I'm, what? Sure! No way! So are we! Yeah! Hey, tell us your name. Oh god, that stare! Yeah, I'm totally an A-list hunter! I'm, I'm not just a stowaway on this ship! I I know exactly what I'm doing! <laughs> oh no! Oh god, already I'm going into this with people having high expectations on me! Why?! Well, okay, so I get to create my character, so I'm here we go! I'm probably gonna be in here for like hours, so I'm gonna go ahead and just skip ahead. All right, after spending entirely too long in the character creation, I think I've gotten somebody I'm pretty proud of right here. She's a pretty badass looking girl. She's ready to go fight some monsters. She looks a little bit more A-lister material right here. She's rocking the really short purple hair because, you know, you don't want to have long hair when going up against monsters. You don't want to have anything hanging off of you so they can grab onto and then, of course, make you their bitch. I do not want that to happen to my character and I don't care if that actually does not actually happen in the game. But just logically speaking, that would just make sense, right? Okay, honestly, I just really, really, really like the short hair. I just think short hairs look just really cute. But hey, 
that's neither here nor there. She's also rocking the scar across the eye because, you know, again, she's a hunter. She's going to have some wounds on her. She's not going to be a, a pinup model all the time. Besides, that's a badass looking scar. Tell me that's not a good looking scar. Tell me that is not a good looking scar. That is a scar I can get behind. So, not only that, but uh, I'm making her kind of a, a fun type because we've got some expressions going on right here. There's different expressions that you can have her go with. And I decided to have kind of like the, the devious trickster kind of going on with more exaggerated expressions. And I already know what many of you are thinking. Yes, I think I kind of defaulted to Chie a little bit. But hey! I can't help it, okay? <laughs> I can't help it. So, so this is how she looks without anything on. And this is how she's going to look going into this because no hunter in the right mind would go and fight monsters naked. <laughs> Now I'm almost tempted to do that just because I said that. But nope, I'm going to go in with some armor. So I'm all set to go. Gonna finish up right here. She is awesome. I get to change her name. And already as I was creating her, I already know a name of what to use. Since I've used other names before in other character creations like Luna and Curie and things like that, I wanted to have a character name specific for her. So she will be her own character. Not somebody that I just brought over or anything. I'm not going to name her Chie or Makoto or Kiri or anything like that. She is going to be Ryoko. So, I mean, it's the same name of a character that I really like from the show that I got my name from. Kagato? Ryoko? Why not? It's a badass name, too. So, alright. Is this name okay? Yes! What is this? Wait. What is a palico? Palicos are felines that have created a pact with hunters to support them in battle during... Wait a minute. This is... What am I doing? This is from the beta. I was able to kind of create one in the beta, so I know exactly what this is. I get to actually create him now instead of doing a preset. Oh, man, this is going to be awesome. So, uh, I'm sorry. I'll be right back. I just made the most adorable little kitty that I could have ever made! He's so cute! He's just so fluffy! He's got white fur and he's just got a big old smile on his face! Deep blue eyes! He's just so adorable! And I get to choose his name! Oh man, I need to think of a proper name to fit such an adorable, adorable huggable creature. Armageddon. Is this name okay? Yes! He's such an enjoyable kid and his name's Armageddon. Start the game with this character now! Let us now go on an adventure! After spending hours and hours in character creation, at long last. So, how about a toast? Uh... Hey, I'm in the cutscene! Awesome! Sure, I'll take some toast. Armageddon is here! To the A-list! And the commission! To Armageddon! <laughs> Being a cat that drinks! <sighs> I love him already! <laughs> so, tell me, what's your theory? The Elder Dragons must migrate to the New World for some reason. Uh, new spawning location? Go for the dragon sex? After running the research commission for 40-odd years, the guild's itching for an answer. They say the Fifth Fleet's got the best shot at crack in this case, and I agree! Keep it down. Hey, speaking of, A-listers usually operate in teams of two. Have you sat down with your partner yet? You see this cat beside me? He's my partner! Me and Armageddon, go and fight monsters. We're totally not stowaways. I know what I'm doing, I swear to God! <laughs> Hi Listen there, person. <sighs> Getting rough out there. The waves are picking up. That's gotta mean landfall. You're on the A-list, right? Yeah, totally. Yeah, do you do. <laughs> I'm not psychic, but I do have pretty good ears. Ah, put her there. I happen to be an A-lister myself. Oh, well, there's no need to brag. <laughs> And we're starting to capsize. Oh my god, your ego has been sinking the ship! Uh, 
That, that is not a Kraken. That is most certainly not a Kraken. That's a mountain. That's a fiery lava mountain that sprang forth from the very, very cold ocean. And it is now devouring our ship. Well, we're dead. This is not what I had in mind when I signed up for Disney Cruise Lines! Armageddon, no! I spent so long on you! And, oh shit, I am now on top of this lava mountain now, aren't I? Oh, there's the ship. Hey guys, I found the ship. We can totally get out of here. Maybe. Um. Oh, I can move now. Hey. All right, nothing around here. Okay, so. Uh, Hello? Anybody there? I'm getting there. Hold on, I'm coming to save the world. One, one capsized ship at a time. Oh, hey, it's you. Look what happened to the ship. Yeah, isn't it awesome? I mean, it's such a tragedy. Uh, we have to do something. Uh, let's go to the backside and push. That, that'll totally work. Maybe if we wish hard it's enough, it'll break here. itself loose. This way. You wish too hard! You wish too hard! Oh, it's the pterodactyls, of course! It's always the pterodactyls' fault! Damn. Uh, that almost crushed my foot. Well, you don't see that every day. <laughs> we need to get out of here. I've got an idea. This way. You have an idea! I'd love to know what this idea is. You know, considering you've never been here before. Or have you? Because if you have... I'd like to know this story. Wait. Oh, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it! Hurry! I'm coming, I'm coming! Yeah. Alright. That was the grand plan. Okay, not that way. What's the grand plan? Okay, up this way. Ooh, that that that's a, that's a that's a lava boil. I'm not even going close to that. Oh God, rock! Watch yourself. I just tanked a boulder with my skull. How strong is this girl? Oh, no. Eat your heart out, Chris Redfield. You punch boulders, I headbutt them. The crowd's moving again. Wait. We're on. I knew it. What? Time to hitch a ride and get off this thing. Come on. First you're shooing them away, now you're trying to hitch a ride off. Like, God damn it! Oh boy. An adventure! Oh, that, that, that'll work. And now the pterodactyl's leg has been snapped in half. Oh, oh, oh no. That's no mountain. That's lava, Cthulhu. Oh, no. Um, we did it! Wow. The new world. Yay! <laughs> Everyone's so happy going about their business. Little do they know that Lava Cthulhu is coming to eat and devour all of their souls in a fiery rage of death. I knew it couldn't support the both of us. You're too fat. I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. Please don't kill me. Uh, hello, game? 
Oh, here we go. Wait, didn't you fall like hundreds of yards the other way? Eh, details. So yeah, we're just sitting. We're just going to ignore so Lava Cthulhu behind us. Ah, uh -uh. no, no, no! I'm going backwards. No, no. Ah, eh, ah, eh, ah, eh, ah. Eh. Oh, it's not gonna let me. Oh, I want to see what Lava Cthulhu was gonna do. Okay, fine. We're just gonna go to this inconspicuous campsite. I found this in the tent. It has a map in it. Well, part of one at least. Then this isn't exactly a new world, is it? People are already here. Looks like we're right around here. The research commission's base of operations is here. This is where our ship was supposed to dock. Oh. For now, I think it would be best if we make our way to base. So already there were people. The map there. should help us find our way. And they were part of us. Hmm. Okay. Adventure! It's a dinosaur, Jesus Christ, what the fuck? Oh my fucking god, fucking dinosaurs, holy shit, what the fuck? The research Commission's headquarters. Come on, let's get going. You mean that ship that's sitting on top of the mountain? That seems to be a theme, isn't it? I had the scout flies memorize my scent earlier. If you lose sight of me, just follow the scout flies, and they'll lead you right to me. Okay, memorize your scent. I hope it was pleasant for them. We can push our way through these vines. All right, I guess I'll go first. There, I broke the way through for you. Ah, the, uh... The tea tree. Everybody knows about the tea tree. It's a national landmark. <laughs> ah. Yeah, stand back. I'll protect you with my... Yeah, I'll protect you. So, uh, how are you? You want to be friends? He, he just wants to be friends. He's singing for us. I'll name him George. He's brought all of his friends to come and hang out with us. Isn't that great? Don't pick a fight if you don't have a weapon. But I've got a knife! Come on, this way. Hurry! Okay, now what? Look for some brush you can hide in. Oh. Hurry up and hide. Oh yeah, this is totally gonna work. They saw us get in here! Peekaboo! Um... I must have scared them off with my amazing A-rank skills. Okay, the coast is clear. Or Let's maybe it was your scent that can. drew them off. Something here. What What's is something this here? Track. Old footprints. I just picked up a footprint off the ground. There's more over there. I just Let's peel it off the ground like, hey, look at this! <laughs> said you're here to eat my friend well I won't stop you campsites just right in front of me I'll just be on my way see I didn't have to do anything some dumbass decided to ride you around this way hurry okay let's go move um yeah you guys have fun with that I'm going this way I guess I can't go this way. Move! Good to look at it! Grab it, grab it! I'm coming! <laughs> it would be funny if I just... Well, something tells me they wouldn't allow me to actually go backwards and explore a bit. Move! That is not good. Oh my oh, god! Get over here! Um... Peace! Yep. 
Please just ignore me. Pay no attention to the girl underneath your ball sack. Just, uh, just, just let me through, please. Don't step on my face. Jump! Clear for everybody! I did it. Hey. You all right? Let's go. Yeah, I'm perfectly fine. We were just chased across the wilderness by a very hungry lizard, and then an even bigger, hungrier lizard showed up and started eating that lizard and nearly stepped on me. I'm perfectly fine! This is the very definition of calm! Uh, uh yeah, we, we did it, guys! Wow. We showed those dinosaurs what's for! <laughs> Amazing, ain't it? And it's all thanks to just me! Just look at this gate. It's like nature meant for us to build a stara right here. Guys! Stara. I like it. Praise me! Stop ignoring me! The rest of the fifth are already here. Oh, really? You're the last to arrive. We assumed you were dead. After all, we found the corpse of your palico washed up on shore. <laughs> oh, poor Armageddon! Okay, set him down here. Take him oh, great. Creepy okay. is here. You guys made it. Be right back. Oh, you You're survived. Alive. Had a rough, huh? Great. When we couldn't find you two, we were starting to sweat bullets. Don't touch me. You scared us. We were talking about going out to look for you. <laughs> All's well that ends well. Hey, we need a hand. Sorry. Hey, Come on. Catch you later. <laughs> yeah, he wants some of this grade A hunter ass right here. This here's our trade yard. I guess the name says it all. Huh. Look at all the people. The stuff. Especially the Incredible. stuff. Right? <laughs> We've got it all here. We've got hunters to do all the exploring, scholars to do the research, technicians to keep them going. This place is the beating heart of the commission. What about what doctors? We don't need doctors. Well, why do we? Remember, we don't need I doctors. Okay, I'll give you the grand tour. Let's start by looking for your palico. He's alive! This Armageddon's alive! They carry most of the basic necessities. You should drop by later to see what they have. Oh, damn. Look at that epic hip sway she's got. Damn! That, that's not just normal walk. She is putting some effort into that strut. Next is the smithy. It's this way. I'm sorry, I, I can't pay attention. I, I don't care about Smithy, just that, that hip sway is just... It's just entrancing. Hmm. Palico? What's a Palico hip sway? You were the Commission's Fifth Fleet, right? Uh, yeah! Yeah, you of course I am! Charge. My grandfather was with the first. That was a long time ago. Me? I'm not with any fleet. Born and bred right here. Never even been to the old world. I don't even know what it's like either. Here's our smithy. This is where you can craft weapons and armor. You'll be here a lot. Woo! Wow! Look at this place. Want to check it out? Yes! Let me go, 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 let me go! You! Next up is the canteen. Let's check it out. No, no, I will follow you in just a minute. Sir, I need a weapon. Second Fleet Master, I want the biggest sword that you have. No, I know what you're thinking. I know exactly what you're thinking. I want the biggest sword that you have. Like that one that's over there? Something like that. But bigger. Give it to me. There you are, Fiber. So, the illustrious fifth has arrived. Welcome, welcome. I hear it was quite rough, huh? <laughs> uh, where's your gear? Um, this is my gear? And wait, isn't it your job to crab me? Give me new gear! I will pay you! I want the biggest sword that you have! Armor? Who needs armor? I got a giant ass sword, that's my armor! Uh, you need equipment. A weapon, at least. Then we'll. Don't you suppose I might go up before everyone is wrong with you? 
You're the blacksmith. You make the weapon for me. It's a fucking mama. <laughs> All right, newcomer. Which of you knows how to have a little fun? <laughs> oh God, I've got a perverted troll to ask me out. Hey there, pretty lady. You want to go on a fun date with mustachioed midget? That's what we're leaving it on? You guys are weird. We got the tech chief that's flirting with me, and we got the second fleet master that refuses to make something for me. He's like, yeah, I'll make you some weapons if you get a weapon. Get the what? S stupid bitches. Armory, okay. Maybe I have to buy something first. Well, what do we have here? A new face, huh? Mm, you don't look like much. You must be the fifth. <laughs> well, welcome to the new world, I guess. Goodbye, Ben. <laughs> Goodbye. We can talk business once you grab yourself. What? Why is everybody here so stupid? <laughs> you have to have a weapon to conduct business in making a weapon. This is bad. Okay, you know what? Um, here, here, here's a bone. That's my weapon. Now make me something. Oh my God. Fine. Canteen first. I oh, guess. Okay, let's head up to the canteen. Sure. Why not? The canteen? I am so there. Oh, are you a drinker? I think this hmm. girl is starting to become a little bit more interesting. Here. Canteen's just up these stairs. Over here. This way. I'm right in front of you. This here's our canteen. Uh, hmm. looks great. Hey, over there. <gasps> Armageddon! Armageddon! Come to mama! That's... Uh, why? Why? I knew you pulled through. I've been betrayed. I've been betrayed by my own cat! Right. They're calling for a council. Come on. Yeah. Oh, I didn't now even get to hug Armageddon! Let us begin council. Shut up! I'm still moping about Armageddon and his acorn shovel. After tracking a migrating elder dragon across the sea. You talking about Lava Cthulhu? That thing was a dragon! The Fifth Fleet have finally arrived in Estera. Give them a warm welcome. Now, we didn't think that those peons would arrive in time. <laughs> Let's clap for them anyway. They're a fine group. Worthy comrades who will help see the Research Commission's long efforts finally rewarded. After all, they're the meat shield, so the actual good people won't die as quickly. <laughs> Would you like to say a few words? <laughs> Thank you, sir. We're ready to roll up our sleeves and get our hands dirty. This here is the Commission's core team. You should all get to know each other. Looking forward to it. Oh, great. Social activity. Oh my god, it's the perverted tech master over there. Now, down to business. The latest monster to make the Elder Crossing is known as Zora Magdaros. A huge monster with a mountain of fire upon its back. Yeah, I'm gonna just call him Lava Cthulhu, thanks. The Research Commission's job is to discover exactly why the Elder Dragons are migrating to the New World. Elder Dragons have been with us since the dawn of time. Oh my god, that cat is awesome. I want him. Altering the ecosystem, reshaping the land, leaving disaster in their wake. Once every decade or so, they flock to this continent. But for what reason? The dragon sex, I'm telling you! They're out here to get it on, it's paradise! With the fifth's help, we will find the missing link. Here, here. Now we're talking! Oh god, he's Scottish. I, I think I like him a little bit more. Because now he's like a dwarf. <laughs> Hunters, for the time being, I need you to focus on investigating our Jagras problem and securing Astera. Oh, great. We get to go kill Jagrases. At least I kind of know what I'm doing with that. I did in the beta. And again, in the beta, I was like geared up to my teeth. Start by investigating the Jagras' habitat. Find out what makes him tick. Then we'll go from there. Right. We're on it, sir. Everyone else, you know the drill. Make sure these hunters have everything they need. Like a weapon? Oh, he talks! 
The muscle cat talks! I want him. You two, make it a priority to learn how we do things around here. You'll find good teachers, so don't be afraid to ask. You heard him. Stick with me and you'll have no problems. The Fifth Banner promises a change in the wind. It's your job to fulfill that promise. All right, dismissed. Uh, I promise not to let you down, Captain. <laughs> mm -hmm. Not even here a whole day and already got your first mission. You really are ready to get your hands dirty. Well, let's go look into the Jagger's problem, but you'll need a weapon first. Thank you! Over here. There's a box full of equipment you can use in your quarters. Come on, I'll show you the way. Um, I, I'm tempted, but I, no, I will not do a Ugandan Knuckles meme. I re I've already mentioned it. I've failed already. Uh, well, I'm sorry. This is my quarters? This is mine? This is mine! I was expecting, like, a hammock hanging off of a cliff or something, but I got a whole giant-ass room to myself? I love it! We play some basic gear for you in that equipment box. Make sure to choose a weapon that suits you. Change equipment! Sword. Yes, I know about armor sets and all that stuff. Sword, 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 Yes! <laughs> the biggest sword that you have. Wanna get going? Your partner's got a quest for you. I think she's over at the canteen. Oh boy! She's probably off gun Once you're ready, head to the canteen. I'll be there waiting with a quest. Alrighty. Oh. He's the chef. He's the chef! Oh my god! I want him! I love him! He's my favorite character! Hey! Welcome to the canteen! The best place for you to boost your hunt! You're from the 5th, right? Well, let me clue you in on what the canteen is all about. GAINS! HEALTH! STAMINA! WHATEVER! MAX GAINS! <laughs> Sick gains, bruh! Dost thou even hoist, madam? Go on and sit down over there at the counter, Scrawny. When you're ready to go get your pre-hunt on, let me know. Hey, Handler, hold on. I'm talking with Cat Chef. Yeah. Oh my God, eating meals. Yes, I know what eating meals does. Okay, pay with money. Do I? Yes, I've got money. Meat, meat platter. Oh my God. This is officially the best thing ever. <laughs> oh my god. I... That alone is gonna make sure I always come back for more. I love it. I love it. 12 times over. Holy crap. Oh yeah, I guess you exist. Hi, and Jesus. Seriously, every- This is a portion. This is a portion in the Monster Hunter universe. No wonder everyone here is jacked to shit. They're having so much food and protein, they're out taking down monsters and dinosaurs and dragons. Damn! Like, even the smart people are probably able to just break your arm in half if you try to do any kind of arm wrestling with them. Hey, buddy, you remember me? Your I'm your best friend! Or not your weapon is uh, I wanna kill something! I wanna kill something! Uh! That's right! Run! Run from your doom! Run from- There's birds. Get the bird, 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 get the no, you cannot live! Get back here! You're not allowed to live! You need to learn no! ammo. I don't want to go on. I familiarize the scout and flies to my scent. <laughs> don't worry, the scout flies have a good strong whiff of my armpit sweat. You'll be able to find me no problem! <laughs> and take it down with one swing! 
And the other guys are like, Daddy? Daddy? Are you sleeping, Daddy? I swear I just made this so terrible. Oh god, I killed Littlefoot's mother. No! Oh, look at them sleeping. They're just having such a grand old time resting. Hurrah! If you're clever, right in the you dick! Use the slinger to distract monsters. <laughs> Take that. Take that. Take that. Take that. Take that. <laughs> Take that. Take that. Oh my God, I'm Dodge their attacks. Don't forget. Oh, I'm sorry. I was just playing around, but I got ball off, off me. All right. All right. All right. All right. I see how it is. I see it out. I uh, oh, slinger torch. Oh my god, they're on fire! Take that. <laughs> hey, you there. Take that. Take that. Take that. Oh, Jesus Christ! Five, five. Oh my. Okay, okay! He's got a hard head! Take that. Uh oh! I missed. Take that! I missed. Take that! I missed. I'm uh, I'm just practicing Jaggers. Is 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 is. Psychopath. Is this normal? Is this normally what happens in Monster Hunter? You just kill everything in sight and you take great joy out of it? Hey, 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 hey! That's mine! That's mine! Get away! You birds! I will kill you. I will kill you. Okay, birds. You know what? Do not eat the corpse of my prey! Still need to get their shit! Yeah. Yeah, that'll that'll learn you. Alright, well, better go follow the flies and get back on track. I'm pretty sure that they're sick of trying to remember the scent of his armpit sweat and try and lead us back to him, so um Onward and ooh, the sky is a beautiful sunset orange. This game is pretty. I need to get a PlayStation 4 Pro. That way this looks even better. But then again, this is going to come out on PC as well, so I might just pick it up on PC because this game, seriously, is gorgeous. What are you guys scared of? Ah, draw! Take that! Draw! Run it out! Draw! Draw! <laughs> and I'll take a piece of you. Meats, raw meats. Let's see. Let us make some meat. Timing is everything. The color of the meat and the song are clues. Nice. That looks so tasty. I don't pay attention to the color. I just listen to the sound. As soon as the song ends is when I pull it up, and it works every time. Lift. <laughs> One more! Hey buddy, I'm cooking up your little brother over here! You want some? It's delicious! Raw meat. Can, can, can I eat the raw meat? Nope, I just put it down. <laughs> Wait, if I could... Oh, I could use it as bait! Oh, I'm a so smart! I'm a smart cookie. 
What are you doing squats over here for? You put more of your scent on more of those flies? You're sick, bro. My sword's nicer than yours. You can gather it's made of metal. The potion to make mega potions. Yours is just made of silly bone. Over here. Over here. Over here. I'm going already. A pack of Jagras. Those are the monsters. Hi. Hi. Take Let's See how you hold up when you're on your own. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Take that, bitches! I missed. They're on the run. Don't let them get away. I'll let them get away. I just need to carve up this family first. You can use them at the smithy. See, then it's worthwhile for me to take my time and cut up every single limb and appendage off. And ooh, mighty Akram Nagana! Right a minute, I mean. Over here! Right here! Right here. Malachite! Am I even going the right way? The... Oh, that's one of those flashy Oops. things. And... Take that. <laughs> oh, come here! Use Flash! Ah! Uh -huh. <laughs> sharpness. Oh yeah, I probably should use a potion, shouldn't I? Yeah, they need to take that. Go, 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 go. Hurrah! And you're dead. And your body checked. Don't roar at me. I roar at you. I am Ryoko, the great sword wielder of justice and jagracide. Right. Oh, no, no. <laughs> That's a lot of them. That's a lot of them. Oh my god, this is bad. 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 There's way too many. I probably. Oh, here we go. The potion, get 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 the potion. Hey, guys! Flashing! Oh, god damn it, I got the box! Flashing! Veteran hunters know to always keep an eye on that gauge. <laughs> Just wrecked them! Okay, let's head home and report back to the old man. Don't mind if I carve up your sister while I'm, uh, while you're still dizzy and confused. There we go, now I can go join her. You're not supposed to kill that many Jagras, she'll just completely make them go stink. I don't care! They're out for my blood! Sorry, Armageddon, didn't mean to do that to you. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I just gun checked him across the damn tree. <laughs> sorry, Armageddon. No, you must not live. Did I kill them all? I killed them all, didn't I? I. Nope, there's one left. There's one left. Yeah, I killed them all. I finished my mission. But you are only supposed to kill seven of them. I don't care! If I work out there taking down all of the Jagrasis in the area, you are only assigned seven! Can't you count? Silly, stupid thing. Mm. So there's no difference in their habitat, but their numbers are increasing, I see. You see? You see? It was a good thing that I took out as many as I did. I was thinking for the future! Uh huh. It may be stating the obvious, but the Jagras aren't the only danger looking around these parts. We've also received reports of the Kestodon herd getting- ah, THAT'S WHAT I WAS KILLING BEFORE! See, I had the foresight to kill things without you having to tell me, because I knew, I knew in my heart, they needed to die. You see, I truly am a hero. I'm not a homicidal maniac bent on killing all wildlife. I'm a hero! <laughs> This must be all because the Sora Madrigos Lava Cthulhu made landfall. It's got everything riled up. Listen up. Well, it's going to be your job to quiet them down. We'd like you to investigate the Kessadon herd and call their numbers. Oh, boy. I'm going along. Why don't you get hurt? 
I did just fine without you, I'll have you know. Turn on chat function now. Yeah, sure. All right. All right. Now that you've got some materials, why don't we head over to the smithy to see what you can do with them? All righty, let's go and go and talk to the smithy and such. But this is going to be a perfect time for me to quit right now. So this is Comic I'm the final boss. I will see you all next time.